First officer's log. Stardate 49253.5. Commander William Riker reporting. Three days ago, the Enterprise docked at Starbase 74 to undergo repairs to a damaged computer core that has been causing erratic performance and low level computer functions. The ship is practically empty, except for a few crew members assigned to direct the Starbase repair teams. Captain Picard granted shore leave to all personnel. Although I am not on board the ship, I am monitoring the repair team's progress from the Starbase. The deadline for completing repairs to the Enterprise is past, and the need to get underway is mounting. However, the Starship will remain virtually empty until all work is completed. The repair team estimates that the computer system will be online in two days, and I have scheduled the rest of the crew to return to the ship at that time. While the delays have been frustrating, no further problems are anticipated. Computer, lay in a course for Kronos. Warp 9. Execute! So, there are Enterprise crew members on board. Lincoln called Dash at an ah! It will not matter. I control life support, navigation, and weapon systems on this ship. Your life is in my hands. I am Kavak. As a Klingon warrior, I can no longer endure this alliance between the Klingon Empire and the Federation. This peace is intolerable. I must return our warrior race to its true nature. We are now en route to the Klingon homeworld. There we will die in battle like true warriors, as intergalactic war between the Federation and Klingon Empire begins by my hand. Yes, I will fight my brothers for the good of the Empire. What battles the galaxy will see. I left clear evidence on Starbase 74 that this mission was executed with the approval of Starfleet's highest ranking officers. <laughs> you look concerned. Of course it is not true. The Federation is too weak for such a glorious plan. But I am a Klingon warrior, and I am not weak. Perhaps you will present a challenge. No battle is full, no victory honorable without the challenge of a worthy adversary. We will play a warrior's game of strength and cunning. Each of you look as if you possess these skills. We shall see if this helps you against a true Klingon warrior. I know your human way. You will pretend to cooperate, and then try to regain control of this ship and sabotage this great mission. To accomplish that task, you 
you must secure access to five levels of the main computer. Of course you will be pitted against me. In 60 minutes we will reach the Klingon homeworld. You are in a race against time. If you manage to succeed, Starfleet will surely award you a medal. If you fail, your blessed enterprise is doomed. That should be enough incentive. <laughs> I am now captain of this ship. You will address me with respect when I speak. You must stop immediately and look at me. When I speak directly to you, you must touch your communicator and answer me. Yes, Captain Kavak. If you do not respond in exactly this manner, you will experience my wrath. Do you understand? Answer! Let the game begin. moving now. Answer! You will be the first to learn the power of a Klingon warrior. I place you in a stasis field. <laughs> has malfunction and drains stasis fields. Vec dosh ok dosh liji! I think I have detected movement at the stern section of the ship. I am flooding the corridors of this section with Bertolt rays. Anyone there is forced to sit bay.
Mev, the crew member who is moving now. Answer me, human! You are no match for a Klingon. I have detected your movements. I am immediately transporting you to the brig, where you will be confined for one minute. Decks are functioning. No matter. It is only a Federation illusion. Unlike the Klingon reality that awaits you. Anyone on a holodeck? Experience Vige. moving now. Respond! Take the challenge of the Klingon sword to determine your destiny. moving now. Answer! Experience Beige. Malfunction. This Federation computer is as frustrating as a Ferengi. You may get assistance from these low-level computer defects, but I still maintain all computer control over navigation and weapon systems.
remember who is moving now. Respond! <laughs> the skill of a Klingon warrior seems more than you can handle. Experience Bish. the highest ranking Federation officer. Answer! Ah, I will call you so well. Cling on for warrior. Are you worthy of this honor, so well? Hmm. Take the challenge of the Klingon sword to determine your destiny. is moving now. Respond! I will tempt you. Dushtivaktach! Choose another crew member. Now! Who did you pick? Ah, why selection, human? You may yet prove to be a challenge. That crew member is placed in a stasis field. Fields are inactive. Who is moving now? 
Answer! Take the challenge of the Klingon sword to determine your destiny. Sovereign, acknowledge. A leader must be tested. Experience beige. Experience, Beige. This computer is as ruthless as a Romulan. Ah. to the bridge. Chalicho! Ah! So this is the command center of the Starship Enterprise. <laughs> and this must be Picard's chair. Так, пало, а? 
It is now. Luck is not with you, humans. We just passed through a localized distortion in the space-time continuum. You have less time than you thought to stop me. I have shut down the turbo lifts. They are all inoperable. If you are on a turbo lift, you are trapped. Computer has reactivated the turbo lifts, but that is of little consequence. You! The crew member who is moving now. I place you in a stasis field. Stasis fields are released. is moving now. Experience Bish. To speak to the crew members with the greatest access to the computer. The most isolinear chips! Respond! Who answered first? Ah, so it is you. 
You exhibit the clever logic of a Vulcan. This concerns me. I have managed to delete one of your access codes. Ha! Lose your highest level chip! Each of you will now take the challenge of the Klingon sword and determine your destiny as follows. Sovel, answer me! Point out your second in command. So, what is your name? That is a child's name. From now on, I will call you Gah, my favorite food. Because you look slimy like a Terran worm, besides. Gah! is always best when eaten. Alive! you worm! Experience Bish! Baldo Kolota! member who is moving now. You demonstrate the aggressive spirit of an Antican. You must be detained. I place you in a stasis field. <laughs>
Admiral Butler. This malfunctioning computer has once again deactivated the stasis fields. Ah. Temporarily diverting power. Gravity is disabled in all rooms in the saucer section. Anyone there will float in space and cannot move. Ha! Gravity is restored. You, the crew member who is moving now. Experience Beige. Of all the starships, in all the galaxies, in all the universes, I had to choose this one. Ah. Is the lowest ranking crew member. Speak up. You are sounding frail. I will call you Pooj. Cling on for weak. Because you lack strength. I'm immediately transporting you to sick bay. Sensors detect movement around the ship again. If you are in a turbo lift, you will be delayed. I have shut down all turbo lifts for one minute.
experience Bij, and learn the strength of a Klingon. Ah! This computer is more warped than our alliance with the Federation. Ah! ah another localized distortion in the space-time continuum. Time is not on your side, humans. You are truly being tested. <laughs> Think you're a challenge? Not yet. I have programmed a power blackout in all rooms of this ship, as he said on Kronos. Those without honor are always in darkness. Only those of you in corridors will be able to move. This Federation ship is wired like a Varengi shuttle. Power is restored. The power blackout program has terminated. I'll be back. moving now. Don't answer. Seeing you is enough. Experience Beesh. You will now take the challenge of the Klingon sword and determine your destiny as follows. You haven't much time.
have initiated a transporter lock to send phasers back to security. Everyone in the saucer section of the ship will lose their phaser. You want them back? Go ahead! Make my millennium. to the computer. Answer! I will tempt you. Who responded first? So you are a coward. You cannot succeed. You do not deserve the glory of death. I offer you the chance to save your pitiful life. launching a shuttle. You may go aboard immediately and leave this ship. Or do you accept? RESPOND! Have you left the ship? If you abandon the others to save yourself, you have dishonored the Federation. Ha! But you will live! me weakling experience beach ah Experience beige. Malfunction. It will not matter. Time is running out. Humans. Is moving now. Answer! Take the challenge of the Klingon sword to determine your destiny. <laughs> Beige. 
This computer has more low-level bugs than Antares 3! Ah! minor victory in this contest, humans. The computer just deleted security level 5. Computer, red alert! I still control navigation and weapon systems. But you can now reach the bridge with only four isolinear chips. The closest to the security room is placed in a stasis field. <laughs> arrived at the Klingon homeworld. All computer access codes are now deleted. Your isolinear chips are useless. The bridge is secure from your childish attempts. You have lost. Computer, slow to one-third impulse. It seems our movements have been detected, and we are being hailed in true Klingon fashion. Computer shields up! Prepare all weapon systems. Attack pattern, K-35! Computer, damage report! 